Good morning, folks. Walt Diego here from beautiful Las Vegas still. <laughs> Lee's Liquor, Flamingo Road. Amazing clowns. We're still here in Las Vegas, July 16th, 2022. And uh, I'm about ready every morning. I'm going to go either to Starbucks or to Smart and Final, about half mile away, both of them. So, what I've got going today on my uh, Wold Diego's wheelchair puller. Okay, we got the basket mounted down to the frame with just some wires for now. But the basket tips up to uh, expose the two car, 12 volt car batteries. Okay. Uh, the reason you want it to flip up is to work on the batteries and then this is also to switch from neutral see this is neutral you switch them in gear both motors go in gear okay then you bring down the cart or the basket and you uh I just just for now this this is just a prototype but later this would all be professionally designed box locking box so you could put stuff in it and lock it up. Okay, snap it. It's hard to do everything with one hand. So anyway, that's what I've done new. And the other thing was uh, the connecting strap. Yesterday afternoon, messing around with it, the connecting strap broke and the darn thing wanted to take off on me. So that's why you got to have the safety trigger, okay? Rather than just a simple on-off button, because I had it on, I was trying to climb a little hill over here. The uh, connecting uh, strap broke, and the darn thing wanted to take off on me. I barely got it shut off in time, but it could have gone. If I was out in traffic or crossing a road or something, uh, the motor and the cart would have taken off on me. So that is definitely a safety item that cannot be ignored. All right, folks, can't stress that enough. You've got to have a, a, a joystick or a button that if so, you take your finger off of it, it stops, okay? There's no two ways about it, all right? That's very important. For watercraft, for ATVs, everything has to have that automatic shut off if you fall off, okay? That's... That's standard uh, industry practice, all right? Okay, folks, let's see how we do. We're, we're just using one of the batteries to go down to the store. Then I'll switch batteries to come back, all right? Okay, folks, talk to you after uh, my little uh, trip to the store. Okay, folks, all right. Uh, <clears throat> no problems getting over here to the store, smart and final. Got my groceries, got it hooked up to the shuttle. No problem. Uh, great, it works perfect. No problems today so far. <laughs> okay. Now to get home with no problems. Kind of a tight fit right here. We gotta make our way over to the intersection. Okay, this is one battery, folks. One battery. Oh, I didn't tell you, I got a new battery charger. Yeah, I got a, found a place that deals nothing in bat batteries and electric carts down there in Henderson. And they uh, hooked me up with a really good, nice battery charger. The no NOCO, N-O-C-O. I'll show it to you later. Anyway, I think I got a good charge on this uh, one battery here. So today I'm uh, gonna see how far I can push it. <clears throat> Made it, a, <clears throat> it's like a half mile down here to the store and uh, so the other half mile back, we'll see how far we make it. My brother's bank. Good morning, Las Vegas. That's uh, on the other side of the Flamingo over there. I gotta get over to the other side and go down the sidewalk back to the party park. Amazing clowns over there.
okay so uh, besides a new battery charger that seems to have done a pretty good job so far um, I told you about the switch very important to have that safety switch is that that broke on me yesterday it was a, a good thing it was just a uh, at-home accident uh, the uh, actual turnbuckle uh, ripped out of the uh, velcro on my hookup straps and the cart took off on me <laughs> it got a couple feet away before I could get it turned off so sure taught me a lesson all right uh, what else what else uh, Heading over here to Sand Hill. That's my first uh, challenge is to get across the major intersection of Flamingo Road in Vegas. It's uh, very busy. Very busy. We're making progress. We're making progress over here. So. Okay, folks. I may be working with the, uh, the battery exchange boys to... Um, commercialize this uh, wheelchair puller. The uh, guy over there took one look at it and said, hey, that would make a great uh, electric wagon to haul stuff. So, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to see if I can make it. Okay. There's my shadow. <laughs> Cruise along here. Hi. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Las Vegas. There's my Starbucks over there. Told you one day I have coffee, the next day I go shopping. But today I went shopping two days in a row. I needed it. Okay. Okay. Remember, I'm going home on one battery. This is one 12 volt car battery, the Duracell. And they're, they're used too, folks, used car batteries. So. Yeah, we're gonna get this thing commercialized. Uh, and then I'll make a few prototypes and just sell them directly to the public. Uh, trying to keep the price under two grand if possible. way I'd want to be out there on the road with the, the cars in uh, Vegas have no mercy the drivers in Vegas they uh, they go 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 all the time boy we're, we're making progress on one battery charge today any bets on whether we can make it all the way home on one one battery charge today. Okay. Smart and Finals in the dirt over there. The dust. You know, this is a good, a good uh, fast walk, really. A good fast walk. Looking at the moon up there and the jack in the box, you can tell I'm moving. We're one with the universe now, folks. My flying behind my space shuttle here. Okay, folks, I um, really don't have any news or nothing to discuss this morning. Uh, you know, until Putin stops his uh, war against Ukraine, I'm not going to give up on uh, pray, praying for that thing to stop and to advocating every chance I get to stop it, knock it off. Let people live in peace, grow their crops, take care of their families, manufacture whatever they manufacture, provide whatever services they provide. And who gives a damn about where they pay their taxes, you know? Everybody knows you got to pay your taxes to somebody. If you, if you want government services, you've got to pay your taxes. It's that simple, folks. 
It's just a matter of how much and whether it's fair or not. So, okay. Beautiful shot. Headed towards the Las Vegas Strip. <laughs> Wouldn't that be something if I take my uh, Wold Diego wheelchair puller down to the Vegas Strip? I think I might just do that, folks. Not today, but I'll, I'll get some uh, pictures, video for you on the Vegas Strip. Look, you can you can almost see it from here. We're only, you know, seven, eight blocks away. Maybe nine or ten, but it's pretty close. This is uh, right here at Flamingo and uh, Flamingo and uh, Vegas Boulevard. It's only up the road right there. You can almost see it from here. From uh, Ray's Place, the party park at uh, 3525 East Flamingo Road. All right, folks, have a great day. It's been a good run today, no problems. God bless. Take care of your families. Have a good one. Wold Diego is over and out.